No, I do not know who his dad says, Steve. Are you there, uh, the 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 Spider Man of Allah, Abbas? Guys, from now from now on, Abbas is the Spider uh, of uh, Spider Man of Allah. He's all over the place. <laughs> Actually, I feel really sorry for this Abbas when he go uh, in in this in uh, in the speaker corner. You will see those guys in uh, speaker corners humiliating him. I really feel sorry for him. Uh... I feel for you, my friend. All right. Come on, come on. We know we are. To the ones give you a chance. He, he cuts me off all the time. Apart shush. Christian prince give you a chance, okay? Yeah. To deal with him through what was that Skype or phone? Yeah. yeah. Skype or chance. He cuts me off shush. all the time. Apart shush. Christian prince give you a chance, okay? Yeah. To deal with him through what was that Skype or phone? Yeah. yeah. Skype or phone? Yeah. He, he did not only butcher you, I was in that program for 10 minutes. I am sorry to say, he did not only butcher you, he made barbecue from you, and then he gave you out and sold you out for people to eat from that barbecue. But your still, opinion. Your opinion. still, you stand out and then say that's your opinion. What is between you something? and Christian Prince? It is there. But as a something. Christian, no, 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 let no, no, me finish. No, no, let no, no, me finish. No, no, no. As a Christian, my brother and I concern that before. we don't want to, we don't want to have a barbecue day after day, every time when you go to the Christian Prince program. It is sad to see because we concern for you. He's going to butcher you again. He's going to butcher you again. And one day, from the shame you brought to the Dawah him, you are not going to be able to come to Speaker's Corner. That makes one less Muslim at the corner. And, on and on that's on. not very good. Can I say something now? You're sure. on and on. Now you made, on and on you, made, and on. you made a lot of claims right now. That Christian prince butchered me. Yes, now, he did. I am saying to you. <laughs> he even emailed me. Why not lady? Didn't he email me? Why don't you tell me, lady? You're telling me be a gentleman. Talk why to me. me Talk lady? to me, brother. No, you tell me. Why not telling her to let me speak? Abbas, it's getting embarrassing. Yes, it is. Yes, I am. Allah is going to kick you out one day. You, you, you guys, guys are, you're you not guys here. Let see? me speak. I and say, God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. Uh, Abbas, you got it wrong. You should say, Allah bless you. <laughs> Secondly, Abbas, you cannot say to non Muslim, God bless you, you idiot. This is haram. Even this, you commit shirk now. A Muslim, he cannot say, God bless you, to non Muslims. Otherwise, he is saying to them, you, The God you worship, which is not my God, bless you. That is shirk. You are a mushrik, Abbas. I feel sorry for you. Now I don't mind, by the way, if Abbas want to talk to me, I, you know, I can open Skype and let him call me. But Abbas, if you one day your wife or your wife she throw you out of the house because of me, don't blame me. I mean, come on, you became the joke of everybody. Now, <clears throat> love from Indonesia. Thank you, my friend from Indonesia. I love all the people from Indonesia, by the way, and I'm so happy to see a lot of people leaving Islam from Indonesia. I received tons and tons of messages in Skype, but they cannot answer everybody. I really apologize. I mean, I open my Skype. You will not believe it. My Skype is like a volcano. You know, you know, like uh, uh, you open it, and the, and the message will start pop, 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 pop. It's like a like a gun machine. Hundreds of like of messages they come, and then how you can answer everybody? It's impossible. Uh, thank you, my friend. I love everybody from Indonesia. From I receive messages from Thailand. From Philippines, from India, from uh, uh, for sure from Europe, from everywhere. God, God is good, and we are helping people to get out of this cult. Now, let us go back to the. Hmm? Uh, let Abbas call me. All right, just because of you. <clears throat> 
guys Abbas want to call me w what we can do now <coughs> Abbas, call me. Let us see Abbas. Abbas, we are Abbas. Let us see. Fix the audio. Okay, Abbas, you can call now. My Skype is open. Um, let us see here. Abbas, we are Abbas. Call me Abbas. Abbas. No, oh, Abbas will not call me unless I call him three times because he's the same as the prophet. He likes to be called three times. The angel Jibreel, when he came to the prophet, he squeezed him three times. Should I squeeze Abbas three times too? What do you mean you cannot? Isn't it your name, Abbas Aga? Isn't that your name? This is the name I have in here. Aga Abbas. This is your name in the front of me. And here I see a picture, and this is supposedly you. So well, what is that? What do you mean you cannot? Why you cannot? Mm, let me call you. I will call you. Here we go. I'm calling Abbas, guys. Here we go. Am I calling him? Here we go. He's not even online. He's not even online. The guy, he keep complaining about calling him, and he's not even online. Let me call you. Let me call you. Let me call you. The Abbas, he, he, he's like a Muslim. He want to win the lotto, but he didn't ever buy it. He keep asking Allah to make him win the lotto. Allah, please make me win the lotto. The first year, the second year, the year after, 10 years, and then Allah, he found out that Muhammad never bought the lotto to make him win it. Uh, Abbas must be driving now. Are you driving, Abbas? Abbas, what are you doing for a living? Are you, are you delivering pizza like, like Jibreel? So all this time saying to me, I want to call you, I want to call you, and now you are not even online? what do you mean wait so you are saying to me i want to call you answer you know when people they see the text you think that this guy he called me like a thousand times and the christian prince is not answering the guy is not even online <coughs> actually if i bus call i will give him something very easy And because Abbas is very well known that he is super, I mean, special person. He's a special person, at least for his mom. As an example, my mom, she used to say that I am the most handsome person in the town. Me. Do you believe it? <laughs> this is how the mothers, they see their kids, brother. I swear by Allah, brother, I go inside the classroom, all the children, they run away because they get scared. But yet my mother, she think I am the best looking uh, kid in the town. And Abbas, uh, his mom, she think he is the smartest person. Hmm. I'm sure uh, the mother of Abbas, she go between her neighbors and she say, you should see my son. He called the guy, his name is a Christian prince. He grabbed him from his nose. 
his nose actually now became like an elephant nose because my son kept grabbing him from his nose and the neighbor she say yeah yeah your son is the best are you kidding me I know it we saw it we have it we download it even we publish it Abbas where are you should I hang up in Skype should I go home Let me try to call him again. <coughs> and look at this beard. You, you see this guy, he think like he's a this guy is a is a <laughs> is a big shake. <laughs> what a shaky guy. Hey. Anyway, let him go. This guy is just a kid. So, you see, uh, Muslims they complain, but you do not know about what. The only way, the only way to make Muslims happy is just to say shahada. They, to believe, not to believe, is not important. To know what Allah is, but it is not important. Not a single Muslim can tell me what even the word Allah means. It is not an Arabic word. Allah is not an Arabic God. And those people are blind people. They are just following, worshiping a name. They do not know what it does mean. Hey Abbas, are you driving? Yeah, hello. Are you driving, Abbas? No, I'm not. Um, basically, you blocked me uh, from this account, so I have to build another account. Mm. And from that account, I just couldn't call you. So no. I had to recover this account back again. Oh, okay, no problem. So, anyway, so Abbas. Anyway, anyway. Anyway, anyway first of all, um, mm. um, few things. Well, are you all right? Your blood pressure is fine because mostly when I speak to you, you got just a bit uh, hyper and I, I, I care for your health, you know? You care for my health, really? Yeah, yeah, I don't want you to have a. Do, do you have Do you have some camel urine with you? So in case like yeah, I, my blood pressure go up, I can drink camel urine, brother. No, I don't have it. Why do you I don't have? It? Okay, are you telling me yeah. you don't buy camel urine? Yeah. Why you don't? Okay, anyway. Uh, no, no, no. Why anyway? No, no, I, I, no, I no, 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 no. Don't change topic. Don't change topic. Uh, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. Why you don't buy camel urine? Aren't you? Are you saying you are not convinced with the medicine of your prophet? Uh, that medicine was I told you before as well. I think you have a bad memory. Was, was, what? Was, was, what? was what? Was what? Was what? Was what? Those people who have a very serious stomach illness. That was only for them. I told you. Only before, for you, them. You forgot. Only for them. Absolutely, only for them. Uh -huh. Okay. So, well, so ho okay. Hold on. Hold on. Ever, okay. Hold on. Hold. Hold on. Okay, okay. Hold on. So, are you saying really that you Muslims? Okay. Are you saying to? Me, are you saying to me that you Muslims? You don't buy camel urine, all of you, and drink it. Yeah, Muslims also buy alcohol as well. They drink alcohol. What it has to do with Islam? Your prophet can use to make even alcohol. That's not the question. I'm asking you. You are, you are saying to me, you are saying to me that this was only an order for this group of people, and they are sick, correct? Um, I will answer you that, but before that, I want to say something. Mm. I've been say holding some, that for many days. Say something. Say something. For many many days, and I was very cross with you. Uh, you have called my noble sister Zara. You call her a whore. Who is your noble sister Zara? Muslim Muslim sister, the one who called. Uh, I don't know her, but she's my Muslim sister. You call her a whore. I mean, what mm. kind of a man call mm. another woman a whore? Okay, I want, I, I want you. To, I want I want to ask you. I want to ask you. Did you your, need to apologize. Did, you know, okay, hold on. Did your prophet say a woman she put a perfume, she is a whore? Did your prophet say that a woman's voice is a aura, which means if she speak to a strange man, she is a whore? Do you agree with him? What kind of a prophet? He say that a, your mother, if she speak to me, she is a whore. Are you a Christian or a Muslim? I'm asking you. Oh, now it's okay. No, you see, you see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, no, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You see, you see. No, the 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 whore for me, the whore for me is every liar. The whore is not about doing sex. The whore. This is what the Bible teach that even the earth committed adultery. Even the earth became a whore. This is about lying. Everybody became a liar. Everybody became fake. So because you are a person who only think about sex, because this is what Islam is about. Now, because I got you busted, your prophet is the one who called her a whore. 
You're a prophet. He said the women voice is a aura and she, she speak to a stranger. She is a whore You're a prophet says a woman if she passed by the street. She is a she is a devil Your prophet says if a woman she would perfume and she passed in the front of people She is a whore the second I mentioned that to you you say to me Are you Christian or a Muslim? So you are saying to me a second ago you said what kind of a man everybody heard you What kind of a man he call a woman a whore? Now I'm asking you, right. what kind of a man your prophet is? What kind of a man your prophet is calling a woman a whore for having a perfume? I will answer that. I will answer that. Go but ahead. you call yourself a Christian prince, mm. meaning you're a follower of Christ. Mm. Christ is the man who even a woman who considered herself to be whore, he didn't even call her whore. Mm. A Samaritan woman. Yeah. Mm. He didn't even call her whore. Mm. Yes. But you call yourself a Christian mm. prince. No, you I'm calling the, uh, people with I call me I, I call that person a whore for no hold on hold on hold on I called her because she is lying right she wasn't lying she was lying I was I was asking lying. about I was asking about the pact of Omar yeah and he was she was telling you pact of Omar of Jerusalem but well, you were giving a pact of Omar in Syria it was a two different pacts stupid there's nothing it's called pact of Omar in Syria you were not giving uh, Jerusalem. Stupid! You were giving stupid! The there's one. no I pact. Of, there's no pact of Omar in Syria. You donkey. So which one were you giving? <laughs> there's nothing. It's called pact of Omar in Syria. You just said I was giving the pact of Omar in Syria. Okay, okay. maybe it was not Syria, but you were not talking so about again. Jerusalem. Again, I agree that you are a donkey. Agree. The pact of Omar is the one signed between uh, Omar and those he he captured them in Jerusalem. So you are a donkey again. Now I'm asking you. Why no, she no, deny? No, no. Why she deny? Hold on. Why she deny? Why she deny the pact of Omar? Unless she is a liar, and a liar, the Bible says, uh, the the Bible says, the Bible call liars. They are whore. Anyone who is who is a liar is a whore. So I'm asking you, are you a whore too? So the one. The I'm one asking you, are you a whore too? Okay. Are you going one. to deny? Are tell you going one. to deny the pact of Omar, which he made? Um, no, 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 don't change the topic. I'll, I'll no, 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 you are the one who opened the away. topic. We want to finish it. Hold on. Are you a whore, or you are a decent person who want to say yes? Omar al Khattab he made or the pact of Omar to I'm ensure the humiliation of the Christians. Yes or no? Okay, I'm not going to let you run away from it. Hmm. Jesus he didn't call a woman whore who was actually a whore. In a true sense, because he forgive her, because he's God, but Jesus, oh, but oh, Je okay, hold on. You you're see, I just you're answer you. I just answer you. I did not call her a whore because she was having sex around. I called her a whore. It's a metaphorical for liars. Now I'm asking you. The Bible well, says, "Are you a whore? You are the whore. I'm not lying. You are the whore." You lie all the time. You lie. Here we go. I'm, I'm, I'm asking you. I, I say it to you. I, I asked her about the pact of Omar. You said I gave her the pact of Omar in Syria. You are a donkey. <laughs> so you are a whore. You are lying. Here we go. This is the pact of Omar. I show her in the screen. Chapter 9, verse 28, 29. And you can go watch the video. It's in the front of you. Why you are lying? You Why you became a whore today? Answer me. Here we go. You are a liar and you are again doing what whore do. What whore? Whore is not only a woman, by the way. This is Islamic version of the story. Whore is anyone who share his life with the devil, which means his purpose of life, to be a liar, to be cheap, to be for sale. You are a whore like everyone else who sell himself for the devil, and he don't, and he deny the truth. It's in the front of you on the screen. This is no, the I pact of um, this, this is the pact, pact of Omar. I want you to read it. I want you to apologize for being a whore, and promise me you will not be a whore again. Go ahead. Can I speak now? No, I want you to read it. Is that the pact of Omar in front of us? There's nothing on the screen. The screen is blank. Is it blank? Blank? Uh, okay, yeah. sorry. Oh, forgive me. Okay, now you see it. Uh, Do you see it? Okay. Is that the, uh, the the pact of Omar? It hasn't come through yet. Mm. This is exactly what I show your uh, uh, Zahra <laughs> in the screen. Okay. And you said to me that why you are doing that. Huh? Here we go. You are doing the same as she did. You are denying. Can I, can I say something? Can no, I say you can say no, you're not. You cannot say anything. I, I want you to read speak? it. Did did I tell the truth when I said to Zahra, you are a liar? Yes or no? Am I allowed to speak? Did I tell Zahra, I want you to answer. Did I say I, I, I was upset from her because she is a liar? And you now support her and you said, I gave her the pact of Omar in Syria, which is proving to me that you are a donkey. This is what I gave her. Are, it's in the screen. It's in the front of you. I want you to read it. This is I why. 
The prophet said, the, the prophet said, I, no, I want you to read and I want you to agree that you are a whore. Because you just deny the same exact what you deny too. I am not. How about that? Well, okay, you just said to I'm me, no, you are, you are, you are because you deny. You said I did lie. You said to me, you, everybody heard you. You said I gave her the pact of Omar in Syria, which is, which is funny. This is what I gave her. It's in the front of you on the screen. And you, you can read by little, yourself. This is Ibn Kathir. Child, man. This is Ibn Kathir. I want you to read it. You, you know, don't hang up. You know, the, the, in the, I am not. I in the, in the, in never in, hang up. Oh, 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 speaker I corner. Here I go. I'm driving now. Okay, then read. You said I gave her. Everybody heard you saying I gave her the pact of Omar in Syria. Everybody heard you. They are a donkey, and you are a liar, and you are being a whore. Otherwise, apologize for lying and say yes. You are right. CP. This is the pact of Omar of Jerusalem. Go ahead, read. Can I say something? No, you cannot say something. You have to I, answer first. Oh, you have to an, you have to answer first. Stop 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 being a donkey. You have to answer first. Admit that you are not being honest. This is always what you do. You talk over and then you you know what you say in the end? At the end, at, at the end, at the end, you are a kid. Here we go, guys. You see, is he is 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 he running away? Why you don't want to no. answer? You are the one. You are the one who opened the topic. You are the one who said to me, "Why you call Zahra such a name?" I'm not calling her such a name. She deserve it, and you deserve it too. Okay. Otherwise, I you a and, okay. and, no, don't ask Let's me a talk. question. Finish the topic first. You are the one who asked me the question. You don't change the topic. You are a coward. I, is it I'm true? Is it true? Is it true what I gave to Zahra? Yes or no? You are not giving me a chance to speak. What's no, no, no. I'm not going to give you a chance. I want you to answer, not speak only. This is the, it's, it's in the front of you. Is that the pact of Omar to the people of Jerusalem to humiliate them, to 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 to, to torture them, to 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 uh, ensure that they are not respected? Yes or no? I prove it to you. You're a liar. If you give me twenty seconds, I will I give you. I will give you a twenty minute. Start reading. No, twenty seconds. No, twenty so minutes. I, you start reading. I, I want you to start reading, and then you answer after you read. There is no point in reading. No, there there's are... a point. No, there's a point because this is about Jerusalem and you are a liar. Read it. If you give me 20 seconds and if I can't prove No, you, liar, why you I don't want to it. read your book? Okay. Why you don't, I'm using an evidence against you. You don't want to read the evidence? No, I have no problem reading it. But yeah. this is not the Then read it. No, 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 no. Here we go. You are the one who called me and you are the one who said to me why you said that. I am answering you now. Now it's your respond. I want you to read it. I said, here we go. This is the evidence. That's what I gave her. And that's why I call her in, uh, that name she because she deserves it and you deserve it too if you don't read it if you don't accept that this is about Jerusalem that's mean you are a whore guys you see he's not letting me speak what can I do no I'm not letting you speak because you are trying to run away from reading it I'm not why don't I read it then go read it go ahead I, I just say to you please read it all and then can, give me that you give me two seconds then I will do read whatever you want me you to promise you, me you, you promise I I promise. Okay, go. You have 20 seconds. Okay, 20 seconds. This, uh, you are you are wrong because the day you call her a whore, you were you, they were not, you were not talking about the pact. You were, she was talking about what happened in New Zealand, and you were talking about the terrorism, and she was angry and cross with you. With what you are a liar. Give me the video. I will play it. No, you are a liar again. You are being a whore again. This is because this is because I asked her about the pact of Omar, and she said oh. I never heard of it. You are a liar again. Now, this is another time you told her that you call her a whore. Mm. That day, he was not talking about the fact, he was talking about the news. Give me the video, I will play it, and you are a whore again. You get busted. Give me the video, I will play it. I don't have the video. Then shut you up. The then you are stupid. I mean, look like you now. Now, you gave me 20 seconds. I gave you 20 seconds to answer. You are done. Go answer, please. Read. You say to me what? now, look, okay, listen, listen. You, you call me just to show you how stupid you are. You call, guys, when he called me, did he say that you gave her the pact of Syria? Did he say that? Now he's saying this is not about the pact. Uh, no, look, look, at, look at this stupid. I mean, you are the you are the one who said to me when she called you. You, you she, she, the, the reason you accuse her of lying. You are lying. You said to me you are lying because you gave her the pact of Syria. I want you to give me the pact of Syria, you donkey. Previous. Uh, what is the pact of Syria, you, you donkey? That day you didn't call her whore. <laughs> so now Abdul, that? listen, listen, listen. Now I want you to read. You did lie, and you said I gave her the pact of Syria, and you said I'm liar. What? I want you, you either to apologize, be a man, say to us, when I called you today, I was I was planning to be a whore. Thank you, Christian Prince, for spanking me and correcting me, and I promise you I will not be a whore again. Now read. Either you admit that this is about Jerusalem, 
or you admit Thank that you. you are a whore. Spanking me, spanking me for what? What are you talking? Because about? you say this is not about Jerusalem. Tell me one thing. See, no, don't tell me one thing. I, don't tell me nothing. Don't, don't tell me not something. No, no, not something. Not something. Is that about? Is that about? Is that about Jerusalem? Is that about Jerusalem? Yes or no? If I am wrong, about is that about Jerusalem? No, don't me if I'm wrong. No, don't tell me you are. If I'm wrong, you said to me you accuse me to be a liar. You were sure a second ago. You are sure you said to me that I gave her sure. the pact of Omar in Syria, which is a stupid to say. That's look that. We talk about a mistake, yeah. The fact of Syria is a what mistake. mistake? So mistake. now it's a mistake. You call me a liar, and but you are the donkey. So say you are a donkey who, who talk about a topic like you that. do not know what it is. I so look at this guy, guys. He, he is thinking like about calling me for the last it's month. Look, 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 look at this donkey. Hold on. This this donkey is thinking about calling me for the last month to talk about this topic. And when he called me, he said that now he made a mistake, he was a donkey. He thought it's about he thought there's something is called the pact of Syria and turn and, and this is what I asked her it turned to me that he was a donkey and I was right is that what you are saying it was not a pact of Syria I was thinking about I was thinking about what you call her a whole Abdul no this is what you said everybody heard you I said I asked her about and she denied the pact of Omar and I and you said yes because you gave her the pact of Syria <laughs> that, was, that was a conversation do you, do you see why I hang up on you you are just a kid I'm in the kid. Okay. I'm having all the right. patient with you. Look at you. Here we go. Okay. Now, why you don't admit that this is the pact of Omar in Jerusalem? Can you say that, please? You are such a child. Can you, you say that, please? Can you say? Can you say yeah. that uh, uh, Abbas with the long beard is an idiot of the village, and he thought that this is something called the pact of Syria? It turned to be the pact of Omar, and Christian Prince is right. Okay. So well, this is a pact of Omar. Yes. This okay. Omar, to, yes. to where? To where? To where? To is that Jerusalem? Was, was, is that Jerusalem? Tell me, tell me one thing. Did you call her a whore when you're talking about? And you are a whore too. And you are a whore too. Did you call her? And you are a whore. Yes, I call her and I call you. No, no, you didn't. No, I call. No, I call you too. You didn't. I call you. No, her. I'm talking about Zach. No, no, and you, you, you are the same because both of you, you commit the same crime. Both of you, you lie. You said, uh, you said there's no such a thing. So somebody made if somebody make a mistake, that's a whore as well. Yeah? No, because they are lying. I'm showing it in the screen, and yet they deny it. How you can okay. deny something? Somebody I show it to you from your book. That means you are a whore. You see, if you are making a mistake, no, 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 no. There's a huge difference between mistake and insisting of lines. Ever she, they are the one who mentioned to me the pact of Omar. She is the one. The pact of Omar. When Omar he enter, you know, he treat the Christian nice. So I said, okay, let's show you the pact of Omar. The same but as you she, did now. When you call, when you call her name. Abdul, 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 you are a donkey. Why you don't admit? Okay, now it's hold on, hold on. I want you to ask. I want to. I want to ask you, what kind of what kind of a man? You are the one who said what kind of a man he called a woman a whore. I'm asking you, what kind of a man he say that a Muslim woman is a whore if she wear a perfume? Okay. You are definitely not a Christian. I'm asking you. No, I am a Christian. No, no, I'm following the I'm following the Bible. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. What kind of a prophet? You are the one who asked me the same question. What kind of a prophet he called your mother a whore if she put a perfume in the front of men? So your mother, she go to the mall and she have perfume according to your prophet, she is a whore. Do you agree with your prophet? Uh, he called her a whore, yeah? Uh, called yeah. a woman a whore who mm -hmm. wears perfume. Yes, yeah, just for having perfume. Okay. Yes or no? Show me the hadith. What do you mean show me the hadith? Uh, uh, tomorrow I will show it to you. That hadith and uh, Anas narrated some people from Urania arrived in Al Madina and they were uncomfortable with the climate. Well, this is a, what, this uh, is the, what, uh, what a climate the hadith, hadith on the screen is about the ah, that one. That one is old, my friend. I will get here. We go. I, I was waking up your prophet from the grave and now he gave me the hadith. Read it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he's already alive, man. Don't worry about it. Yeah, he's already alive. This that's a lie, my friend. Even your prophet, he says, I am, I will be the first to be resurrected. So he's dead. Stop lying. Let's see the word we're looking for. Now read the hadith. Read the hadith. Read the hadith. Let everybody laugh at you. What kind of a prophet he consider women a whore if she have a perfume? I'm reading. Read it. Go ahead. The Messenger of Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Any woman who puts on perfume, then passes by people so that they can smell her fragrance, then she is an adulteress." Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So he's an adulteress. She is a whore. She is a whore. Zania. Adulteress. Zania. Whore. This is the word Zania whore. She is a whore. What a what a daughter is mean. What a daughter is mean. What a daughter is mean. A whore. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. Okay. Now, 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 
why if a woman she have a perfume smell. and people they smell her perfume she is a whore no, because he said this will happen this will, this will follow well, this will why happen. why you she must them, she, why are you saying to she, me you must them men like dogs you you sniff and you walk just a woman a woman walk by she have a perfume you sniff like a like a dog and you start sniffing her ass i mean what do you mean they follow what do you what do you mean she is just a woman yeah. putting a perfume your prophet he used to put perfume right yes when jesus so, says no, I, hold on shut up shut up shut up why you're a prophet when he put a perfume he is not a whore but when a woman she put a perfume she's a whore answering i'm answering you mm, okay right? because when jesus says if you look at the woman you already commit adultery mm. that means you no no jesus did not say that no 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 you are a liar no you are a liar you're a pro no don't lie jesus okay. said if you wish to have a woman she is not yours look at the women is not about looking at the women you are a liar you are you are you are misquoting the bible it's about desiring a woman she is not yours here a woman she walks shut up shut up liar donkey why you're a prophet why you're a prophet he can put a perfume and he is not a whore but if your mother she put a perfume she is a whore Papa, prophet put the perfume what are you talking about prophet put the perfume it's, he's talking about the women here i'm asking because are you saying to me your prophet he did not your prophet did not uh, have, uh, use perfume of course he used perfume and he told okay. men to use so why to okay so why you're a prophet he can use perfume but if a woman and he is not a whore uh, 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 <laughs> but if a woman she use it <laughs> she's a whore I'm, I'm going to give answer because this is why i always say you have a lot of information but very little knowledge because you don't think through things you oh. don't think deep okay go on so take us through brother brother you take us through I, Mm. There is a difference between men and women. Yeah, like a man, mm. if he is wearing a, a t-shirt mm. or wearing a, like you know a <coughs> shorts up to the knees, uh, walking in the middle. Even man wearing underwear, walking in the middle of the street, and there are four women standing on the corner. Man has no fear. Man will not fear that women are going to rape him or anything will happen to him. Mm. But same thing if you reverse, a so woman do that. Chances are, if they're a good man, that's fine. But if there's a bad man. The chances are the woman will be attacked and woman can be mm. abused or raped. Mm. So there's a difference here. So when man So you are saying to me, you are saying to me that you Muslim men, if you see, if you smell some perfume, you go crazy and you rape women. And you are saying to me, it's not only uh, let, let me show you how any stupid man, what you just man. said. No, let me show you what you what how any stupid man. what you let me show you how stupid what you said. You're a prophet, he did not say, he can say, don't put perfume and get out so men they might harm you. He did not say that. He said the women she but perfume she is a whore, and there's a huge difference. He can he can guide the he can no 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 listen listen. Secondly secondly, what about women kidnapping your prophet and raping him? Yeah, does he it but, happen? He but perfume it can happen. Why not? Yes, there's I I heard the stories about women they kidnap men and they rape them. Yes, that's true. No, does it happen to yes you know actually I read a story just last summer about a woman uh, she she put a knife in the in the neck of the dry the taxi driver and she forced him to have sex with her <laughs> you believe it or not so look at look at the stupidity of your prophet look how insulting look how insulting look how insulting your prophet is your prophet saying if a woman she put perfume she is a whore but he encouraged himself and look what he said he said my favorite thing in the world is perfume and women is that true my favorite thing yeah why not so the prophet he can say everything well. guys look at this look at this my favorite thing H hold on <laughs> your prophet says my favorite my favorite things in this earth is women and perfume but if a woman she have a perfume she is a whore look what he's saying he's saying man. look what he's How saying he is saying women he was he love women he love women okay so um, uh, Muhammad can be womanizer but if a woman if a woman she want to attract men you said to me if she wore perfume she's attracting men right so your prophet he put perfume to attract women he's a womanizer and he say that loud and clear but yet he is not a whore but if a woman she just by adding a perfume she is a whore okay he look, I told you exactly why was the difference here no there's no you are a liar my friend no you are a liar you are a liar you are a big fat liar can you quote for me a case where in, in uh, uh, no no can you show me a case can you show me a case where in Arabia a woman she have a perfume in the time of your prophet and people rape her because she have a perfume uh, do you agree that women wearing a perfume too much affects men you agree what no the, the nice uh, smell people put perfume because it, they want to smell good I mean hold on hold on 
Uh, if every woman she put a perfume yeah, just because yeah. of a man, that's stupid of you to say. Secondly, the women she have the right the same as the man. Why the man he can have smell good, but the women she can't smell good. The women she can be tempted by a man too. So you put a perfume, you are tempting women. So why she she is guilty of tempting men, but you are not guilty of tempting women. Do you do you agree that prophet many times give advice rather than commandments? Uh, the prophet never give advice. Your prophet yeah. is your prophet. Your prophet is a perverted man. Let me give you the advice. You're a prophet. He said. You're a prophet. You're a, okay. Let me ask you. Is your prophet never give advice? Do you believe that your mother is the devil? No, no. You said. Do you believe that your mother? Do you believe that your mother is the devil? She come in the image of the devil and she live in the image of the devil. Be a man. Don't be CB, do CB. Don't CB me. Don't CB me. I'm asking you. You're a prophet. Say this is the advice of your prophet. Read carefully. You're a prophet no, no, while no, sitting. Shut, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Listen, sure guys, look at this. The prophet, no, he saw a no. woman. This this woman is not even wearing a perfume. The prophet of Allah, he, he just quote for me that Jesus said, If you wish a woman, she is not yours, you committed adultery. Muhammad is adulterer according to, to, to Jesus. Woman, shut up shut up shut up no if you see a woman you desire her it's not a woman people they see women in the street all day long this is what Jesus is talking about don't lie if you desire a woman she is not yours it's better for you to unblock your eye from going to hellfire look what your prophet did your prophet yeah. is married women she walk by and he have his friends sitting with him Muhammad he keeps staring at her until he got horny there's no way by seeing a woman you get horny right away even donkeys don't do that so look what happened to your prophet he saw a woman so he come to his wife Zainab and she was busy doing tanning for the leather which means she is busy she's really busy and he has sexual intercourse with her it's like a donkey stuff you don't like it it's not like time to go to bed she is busy no take off your panty lift up your legs I saw a woman in the street I want to do you that's how it is and then look he came back now Muhammad is done so Muhammad now he got his desire done because what because he saw a woman she is not his wife and then he said the women she advances and retires in the shape of the devil. Do you agree that your prophet saying so that you your mother? You don't, uh, are you agreeing? Are people you people agreeing people. that your mother she retire and advance in the shape of the devil? Zippy Zippy, can I ask you something? No, you cannot. I want you to answer me, ZB ZB. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> get lost, kid. Get lost. Get lost. You see why I block you? Yeah, it's just a donkey. And now the the people in speaker corners they will take this video and they will make fun of you for the coming two months. And you are a whore. A whore is anyone is a liar. The whore of Babylon. Maybe you do not even know what does that mean. Those who sleep with the devil, they are a whore. That's what whore is about. It's not about only about sex. And this is your prophet and this is your hypocrisy what kind of a prophet what kind of a man he call a woman a whore this is what you said to me uh, my blood pressure is very okay <laughs> uh, christian prince is your blood pressure yes brother i have a camel you're in here brother <laughs> hmm. stupid idiot I feel sorry that imagine this guy he is married he have kids I feel sorry for your family the women she advances and retires in the shape of the devil what a shameful man how dare you are you saying to me Muhammad that your mother she is a shape of a devil is that what a man he says about his his his, his mother I am not fair enough. I will never be fair enough with liars. If you are committed to say a lie, I will spank you. Fair enough with a liar. He says to me, I gave her 
the pact of Omar in Syria. What a donkey. And he refused to read. And he promised me he will read. He, re he, never, he never read because he's ashamed of it. The prophet said, don't initiate the salam to the Jews and the Christians. And if you meet any of them, force them to the most narrow alley. Which means the prophet of the most peaceful prophet teaching the Muslims the good ethic. If you see a Christian in the street, push him to walk in the sewage. This is why the leader of the faithful Umar al Khattab, may Allah be pleased with him, demanded his well known conditions to be met in the Christians to ensure their humiliation. Do you see it? You are not fair, Christian Prince. I want to be fair with those who want to ensure my humiliation. I have to be fair with the liars who we get them busted. No, I am being fair. I ask him a hundred times to read it. They do not know the truth. No, I don't agree with you. They knew the truth. They are they are corrupt. He knew the truth. It's in the front of him. But he they have to play as dumb. They I, I like you. Uh, I know what. Why? Where? Why? How? How? It's not okay for a Christian prince to use the word whore, but it's okay for his pro his prophet to call his mother a whore. I never saw a single Muslim woman she go in the street without having a perfume, which means according to Muhammad, every single Muslim woman, according to him, she is a whore. And why the prophet he can have a perfume and yet he is not a whore? Why? What kind of uh, guidance that is? Why always you blame the women? So the women now what? We, we, we bury her inside the house, we put her in the box. She cannot have a perfume. She cannot take care from her face. Muhammad, he said, if a Muslim woman, she take care from her face, Allah will curse her. So what? You want her to be like a monkey? So she cannot put a perfume. She cannot take her, 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 her hair from her face. Not even in front of her husband. <laughs> you see, the Muslims, they always play that I do not know. And this guy, he is supposedly, he want to talk to me about this topic for a month. And then after two seconds, we get him busted. You talk to her about the Pact of Syria. What? Pact of Syria? What is that? What is that, the Pact of Syria? I want to understand. Even Muhammad, he described women are equal to donkeys. Muhammad, he said that three things interrupt a Muslim prayer. What are they? black dog a donkey and a woman and a black dog <clears throat> read carefully when men perform salat and there is nothing in front of him like a post of a saddle or a camel saddle then his salat is uh, served by passing off a black dog a woman and a donkey do you see it You put the women between a black dog and a donkey? It's a clearly that the view of women in Islam is disgusting. Even Muhammad, you see the Muslim, they say that uh, uh, Islam is against, uh, the Muslim, they claim that the Bible blame Eve for the sin of Adam. This is what they say. Look what Muhammad is saying. If not Eve, no women betray her husband. Do you see it? Muhammad, he believed that Eve, she betray her husband. And all women, they betray their husband. All women, they are a whore. 
what betray her husband Khanat what the word in Arabic Khanat if not Hawa was a whore she betray her husband no women she will betray her husband do you see it the Prophet never give advice well, guys the, the Prophet never give advice let me show you what the Prophet he gave advice for the women you want to see the advice your Prophet he gave he gave women advice that they have to give their nipples to be sucked and look at the stupid Prophet a woman she if she put a perfume she is a whore If a woman she put a perfume she is a whore but the prophet ordering Muslim women to give their breasts to strangers to suckle them she is a good woman this is advice and then Aisha she start ordering her nieces and her sisters to give their nipples to strange men to suckle it ten times so they can enter upon her so do you see the advice are you there uh, Abbas ibn Farnas you see the advice That is the advice of your prophet. A woman, she came to your prophet. She says, "My husband, he 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 have a bad look about the guy who is entering my house, and he is a growing man." The prophet, he said, advising, as you said, no, the prophet he gave advice. But look at his advice. Suckle him. She said, "How I'm going to suckle him, and he's a growing man." So look at this stupid religion. If a woman she put a perfume, she is a whore. But a Muslim woman, she been ordered by the Prophet to give her nipples to a man who is adult. Are you there, Abbas? Do you like this advice, Abbas? Do you like this advice, Abbas? No, you cannot call. I don't want to talk to you no more. You're just a kid. Let your dad call me. I promise you, if your dad call me, I will talk to him. Abbas he said that the Prophet he gave advice we have to admit yes he gave advice but his advice is disgusting and contradicting the ethic the women if she walk by in the street and she have perfume she is a whore but a Muslim woman she been ordered to give her boobs and do drive it through suckling and by the way even the Quran have a verses about the breast this is not only in the hadith but sadly as you remember the goat ate the Quran you remember the story the goat ate the Quran? May Allah curse that goat. This is was in the Quran about the ten time breastfeeding for adult, as you see. But a goat which is sent by Netanyahu, by the Jews, obviously, she ate the Quran. And now we don't have those verses in the Quran. What do you say? Allah he ordering Muslim women to give their boobs to strangers to suckle them ten different time and they, they will suckle what there's no milk what do you think the women she have a faucet of milk there in her breast yeah, even goats don't have milk always females they give milk one day after delivery they don't have milk 20 uh, 12 months a year <laughs> uh. Uh, the one is asking about Patreon. Yes, Patreon is good. Anyway, you anywhere you send donation, they take a good amount from it. Anyway, but Patreon is better than uh, YouTube. What do you say, Muslims? <coughs> hmm? So look here at the at this uh, mad religion. You know, the Muslim they keep saying to us women. Muslim women they have to wear burqa Muslim women I mean what burqa so a woman she cannot show her face but she can give her boobs boobs hey sister can I suckle your boobs absolutely but please don't shake my hands it's haram really
That's that's cool. It's haram to shake hands with Muslim women, brother. But you can shake their boobs and you can suckle them ten days, not ten time only. By the way, you have to do it in two in ten different time. This is why the guy he could not meet Aisha because her sister she suckled him only three days. She had to do it ten time. Yeah, even if it's nine time and a half. And by the way, nine, ten time is not like you put your mouth in the nipples and you're done. No, you have to keep suckling until you are satisfied. It's a must. So like if you're unsatisfied in ten hours, keep going. Put your head in her lap. <coughs> hey, ZB, are you busy, ZB? Um, don't you see, brother, I'm suckling? Shut up. The husband will come to the house. He will find a man sitting in the couch of his wife in her lap and he is suckling her boobs. And this is halal. The husband, he cannot be upset. And Aisha, she ordered her sisters so they will do suckle any man when they enter upon her. She is, she have secretary and the secretary job to have their breast in the table. You are a man, you want to see Aisha, you enter the secretary room, the nursing room, and you suckle the sisters of Aisha. Okay, now, are you satisfied? Okay, so this is number one. You have to come tomorrow again, okay? So you have to do that 10 times, and that will make her le legal for you to meet her. And yet you are talking about uh, ethic. And yeah, you know, imagine the man, if a woman, she is good looking and she have nice breast and she asks him, are you satisfied, honey? <laughs> Actually, I'm glad that the Muslims are not following this no more. Otherwise, a lot of men, they will convert to Islam. And uh, brother Abbas, he will come back home every day and he will find a long line of men in his door, all the neighborhood. Why this liar CP never showed the two verses after 3330? Uh, uh, okay, I will show you the two verses after 330 and what, what that will do. Guys, why this uh, liar? Don't show the verses after 3, 33, uh, 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 33, 50. I will go, guys, and I will show you the verses after. You are the one who asked for it. Eh, not my fault. Your wish is going to come true. Hmm. Guys, isn't him who asked for this wish? Read with me. Isn't it, this is his wish? Brother? This is his wish, and we have to make the Muslim wish come true. So he's asking us to show what is the verse after number 50. Are you sure? A brother, you want to call a friend before you make such a mistake? Are you sure? Okay, he is sure. Here we go. The verse after 50, it says that you're a prophet. Look what happened, guys. Muhammad, he made the verses saying, any woman, she can give herself to the prophet so he can F her. And then the prophet he got busted a lot of women who is not good looking they start coming so muhammad you have to fix that so look what he says allah told me that any women i like i can if right away and any women i dislike i can differ you are the one who asked me to read the verses after right allah is talking allah is saying to muhammad women in the verse number 50 women they can offer themselves to you so you can if them and the verse after it, because women who they are not good looking or old, Muhammad, he don't want to sleep with them. So now he, he, he have to escape. Not all the women, he will sleep with them. So he will say, oh, Allah, he allowed me from those who offer themselves to differ between them. Do you see it? So you are the one who asked me to read the verse after it. Are you happy? What is the guy who said, why well, you don't read the verses after? <laughs> Look what happened to the, to Muhammad. Muhammad, he says, any woman she's gonna give herself to me, come, come, just come. And the women they start coming. All of them they are old, who they are looking for security. At that time, there's no retirement. 
if you don't have a rich husband powerful husband you know you will die from hunger so they said to themselves if we sleep with him we will be considered as his his women yes we are not his wives but we will have security forever so they start lying up in the front of his door all of them they are all don't nobody want to marry them and now Muhammad he found that himself he got busted like what I did to myself I said any women she can offer herself I did not say any ugly women I did not say any old women excuse my language I said I, I want I meant it only beautiful women so now in, in order to escape what he did to himself he fabricated this verse saying that Allah told me you can differ between those women do you see it where is the Abdul he said to me read it all you women who did hijrah are lawful not all believing women you are a liar Abdul it says here clearly let me get you busted any believing women you are just as uh, officially stupid and a believing woman if she gave her so that the prophet so stop lying stop lying and why this is a privilege to Muhammad what about the Muslim men they can have the same why Muhammad needed such a privilege Allah concerned about his penis hmm? <clears throat> what does this have to do with religion correct guys what does this have to do with Allah why Allah the man he have already 13 wives he have many sex slaves so what that will do to Islam what the what the point Muhammad should be busy he have no time even for women he should be praying the preaching teaching no 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 any women she can give herself to the Prophet what that what what that concern Allah he is not showing oh, okay yeah, oh, no, 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 hold on, hold on. It is not allowed to thee to take any women after that, right? Yeah, but he, he opened license. He have already all what he want. What do you mean he cannot? He cannot exchange them. But he can have unlimited. Any women, she can give herself to the Prophet. Any women. <laughs> and by the way, did you see where it says here you cannot exchange them? Do you know what the Arab used to do? They used to exchange women. They exchange. If you have my book, Six and Allah, you will see that Arab, they used to exchange their wives. And Muhammad, obviously, he was doing the same. Otherwise, you, you tell me, it doesn't say, by the way, just don't change them. What do you mean change them? Are they uh, uh, tools? What change them? What about divorce them? Here it says change them. Any Abdul? <clears throat> 